frightened. Nina, it's okay. Don't worry about it. We've, we've boarded the doors, we've barricaded the windows. We'll be safe for at least an hour, which is about the length of an episode of Condensed Classics. Welcome, everybody. So, we just sit here now and relax and watch tonight's episode of Citizen Kane? Well, I guess if we're going to be eaten by the rotting Walking Dead, at least we get to watch a quality movie as our last desperate gasp. Oh, well, darling, uh... <clears throat> I hate to break it to you, but our producers decided that, uh, well, since our studio is, after all, under siege by, uh, <laughs> zombies, and by the way, by saying under siege and zombie in the same sentence, I am in no way commenting on the acting process of Steven Seagal. <sighs> no, Nina, our producers decided at the last moment that it might be more appropriate to show, uh, Night of the Living Dead. <sighs> Crazy. Man, those undead bitches out there can really howl, can't they? <laughs> Great choice, Tate. Like, I'm not already fearing for my life enough, and now I have to sit through Night of the Living Dead to top it off? You can always do what most of the uh, guests on Condensed Classics here do, which is sleep through two-thirds of it. What? So I can wake up dead? <laughs> no thanks. Wake up dead. Okay, uh, tonight, our movie tonight was supposed to be Citizen Kane, but let's face it, condensed Kane, Rosebud. Hey, I have a newspaper. Man, that girl really can't sing. I mean, she's not a singer. Damn it, was a slut all along? You'd miss all the nuance as well as put into the film. And furthermore... Dave, they're getting louder out there. Are we gonna die? I would say that's highly likely, Nandy, yes. So, what the hell? <clears throat> well, I... Usually never drink, but since I'll soon be a member of the fraternity of the Walking Dead, well, you know, I hear that alcohol actually preserves your corpse, so... <laughs> ah, indeed it does, Nina. Especially when you pour it all over yourself. At any rate, our movie tonight is George A. Romero's Night of the Living Dead, and if the defenses we set up outside the movie lounge, um, barbed wire, boards with nails in them... And randomly firing machine gun Tourette's. There we go now. Uh, keep us safe for a while. We'll see you in a bit. Come on, Barb. Church was this morning, huh? 